Hello everybody, good day to you all today. I am talking about Tales of the Jedi season, season well, this is season number one, episode, episode number eight, one through six here. It's a six episode miniseries. I don't think, they're gonna, I'm not sure they're gonna do, they're gonna, they're gonna do a, a, a second season of this, but if they do, I, I, I kinda, I'll be kind of cool to see what see, 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 see character they're gonna, they're gonna talk about next. <clears throat> but overall, this, 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 these six episodes focuses mostly on Ahsoka and Dooku. And it also brings more light to Dooku, gives you more understanding of who he is as a character. As a matter of fact, you make you make you see things from his point of view way more than, than the Jedi. As a matter of fact, you agree with him a lot of times more so than the Jedi, and you actually can understand why he turned to the dark side in the first place because what he, because the Jedi were useless. They pretty were because the thing is though they were so busy trying to follow the rules, stay impartial, and, and they pretty much in a way kind of became. The um the sinners lap dogs, and all they all, all they were doing was helping out the rich, and that's pretty much it. And while the people who were poor and being and being taken advantage of by the sinners were suffering, and the Jedi did nothing about it. And you got Dooku finally starting to see exactly just how much the Jedi actually do, and how effective they actually are, and that, and that they're pretty much useless in the whole grand scheme of things. You know, what I'm saying what are we doing? And you and you start to see that he how he started to turn it against them and start to see things from a different different point of view and also the anger and frustration that he has as well as, as well. And you also get let I me mean, also focus on Ahsoka. Now we don't explore that much about her that much, but we do get more her, her backstory where she comes from, her people, and you get a little bit a, a little bit of um how how they um they, how they do things, how, how how things run in their in their tribe. Also, you also see how she got discovered, how her power started in the first place, and also seeing her training with uh, with uh, with Anakin and how he's trying to prepare her to be like, the, like strong and maybe take care of herself when th when things when these um, when things went down. And you also seen a little bit of, of how things fell with the Jedi as well too, and how she became how she, how she was like on the run and, and by herself, which is kind of interesting. Like this, and it was trying to make her strong so she could beat she could, so she could stand alone and be by herself. And then, and then when the Jedi fell, she she ended up being by herself as, as, as well. It's just really messed up as, as well as well. But 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 from the animation point of view, the visual effects and how things looked in here, the character, and the background design, all that stuff was just amazing. The music choice they had in here that they they played for each um for the episode which was a a, a a a great choice as well as well. I really did enjoy these stories a whole lot, especially the whole Dooku story. I really did enjoy them a, a lot because you really do get to know him so much, and that. You 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 start to you really get a better understanding of him than you than you do from the prequels. Because you, you, he keeps, now, now you feel fully fleshed out. And, you, and when you so now you, if you ask the prequels, you were just, you were just, oh, I understand why he went bad. And I, and I get it. Matter of fact, I actually agree with him. Because even, you even get a better understanding of Palpatine in a lot of, a lot of ways as well, too. Because the Jedi really did fail the people. See, that's one thing about the Jedi. I have a problem with the Jedi as well too. I like I like the whole uh, the whole Force power and stuff like that as well too. But I have a problem with both the Jedi and the Sith. None of them are right to me. To me, I always thought the Jedi were wrong and the Sith were wrong because they're they're two extremes on two ends. You got the Jedi who don't who don't want to show um any feelings to one another, so they don't they don't get married. They don't they don't get they pretty much become monks. They, they they don't they, they don't get angry and they, they pretty much like suppress any dark thoughts because they, they, they gotta be good and pure but that but that's not a real person. Everybody has good and darkness inside of them. Everybody can make good decisions. They can make some horrible decisions as well too. Be, getting angry isn't a bad thing. Actually, falling falling in love with somebody isn't a bad thing. Those are good things. I mean, yes, you could get mad, but it, it, don't let that anger kind of control you by suppressing it and keeping it like this too. When, when people get frustrated. They, they always seem to turn to the dark side because that's the only way they actually beat themselves and be free, which is which is really messed up. People are gray. If they found to find a way to like use the dark side as well as the light, because because power, it, dark side, light side, it doesn't really matter. It's not evil. It's how you use it in the person who's using the power. If they manage to balance it. And say use the dark side of the force and the light side of the force and combine them together, and then and they, they will truly have true balance. But since but since the Jedi was so focused on trying to be good all the time, they they did not see a lot of the evil that was creeping into them. They didn't see Palpatine slowly drink run to the ranks because they were so busy ignoring all that stuff. They didn't see uh, how, how all the people were being mistreated on, in the bottom, and by the sin was just told to take advantage of these people because they were so busy trying to be like. Righteous that 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 that, that, that um, they pretty much failed everybody, and so when Dooku was seeing all this stuff going around, he was just y'all y'all suck, 
and you and you get it, and you get it. This story was told. It was all the story was told beautifully, well done. Really, I get an understanding of these characters. I I I, I, I wish they I, I wish they, um they actually just did a solo series just on Ahsoka and another solo series just on Dooku by himself and really and really to watch and really and go in depth into the whole third until you, like, you see them like finally into the, the last final stage. But overall, I still, I still did enjoy these shorts. I had a whole lot of fun watching. Them. Like I said, from the animation standpoint, fantastic. From the voice actors, I thought they did an amazing job there. To so the music choices they had for the background, I thought it was beautifully well done. I, I, I really did enjoy these. I, I, so far, Star Wars has really been killing it this year when it comes to their storytelling. I really am enjoying it a whole lot. So, I give this series a grade. I'm giving it an A because I really enjoyed it that much. I'm giving it an A. I'm giving it a solid A. Don't take my word for it. Go check it out for yourself. Hopefully, when you watch it, you will enjoy it. Have fun watching it too. Because, oh, like, wow. Because I just, it, 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 like, it, it makes the prequels a whole lot better as well too. Because, because you, because you, because you, 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 you get a better understanding of these characters. Even the, like, even, even, even made Palpatine seem like, like a lot more interesting of a character as well too. Because, like I said. The Empire saw the how how um the how the um the Jedi and and, and the Senate was like, was screwing people over, in a way. And the, uh, it, the only reason why they was able to rise to power because the Jedi failed hard. Yeah. In a way, it's kind of their fault. They're here. Oh, that's kind of messed up. Yeah, because Palpatine, he's bad. He's evil. But at the same time, he really did help, though. I mean, yes, he he he, 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 he gave a, dict a, a, a dictatorship and everybody's under their rule, but 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 the people the people weren't weren't poor. They actually were being taken care of. Yeah, they gotta follow the strict rules, and they didn't. They probably get wiped out. But that's well, that's kind of extreme. But still, <laughs> they had food to eat, and I guess I can see people. about people like to turn to them and say, "The empire is helping us." Yes, thank you. Like, oh, so sad. So yeah, great episode. Check it out for yourself. So give my channel a like, hit the thumbs up, shut up, and subscribe to my channel and share. I really do appreciate it. Also, links down below. Can I share my social media? You want to follow me there? Thank you. Also, to my stories where I sell things. This is one, this is one of my, my shirts that I sell right here. This is called the Clone Shirt. And, and many others as well. Check it out. See some stuff. Buy some stuff if you do. Thank you for the, thank you for that as well. So thank you for your support. So like I always say, in my dreams of a life, I am the Ninja Rabbit. Uh, peace out, uh, peoples.